Well, the Tennessee Emergency Management Agency expects almost one and a half million people to drive to the volunteer state for the solar eclipse. So we sent Kayla Strayer to the I-75 Welcome Center in East Ridge to find some people from out of state making their way here. She joins us now. Kayla, what did you find and who did you find? You know, Calvin and Kim, with a sign like this, check it out. No surprise, I found a lot of people to talk to. Many of them are from Florida. They're driving up I-75 to come and see some of the best eclipse viewing in the country. Check it out. Yeah, it's hot out here. How are you? Good. Are you in town for the eclipse? Today's assignment, hold up this sign. It seems easy. Come talk to me. But for me, anyone? No? Okay, bye. It got a little rough at times. You didn't see that. Thankfully, I started meeting lots of friendly people who fit the bill. So tell me what brings you up to Tennessee. Eclipse. Hopefully be on the path of totality. How long have you been planning this? About two and a half years since we found out. <laughs> Felix Luciano drove up I-75 from we south of Atlanta. He's in an astronomy we club know. and came okay. with these free them. eclipse glasses to hand out. From your standard glasses to welding helmets, people are bringing a variety of things to see the eclipse here in Tennessee. Does it work? Oh, wow, it does work. Why now are you driving to Nashville? See the grandbabies. No, to see the eclipse. <laughs> well, mainly to see the grandbabies. And the eclipse. Whatever your reasons for coming up the interstate, the Tennessee Emergency Management Agency expects you to be joined by 1.4 million new friends. And of course, you're sure to see something spectacular on Monday. How was the drive coming up here so far? It was excellent. Atlanta was a little slow, but it was, wasn't too bad for Atlanta. And uh, I brought a telescope and I've got the glasses and everything. I'm ready to go. It's pretty fun out there embarrassing myself. A few travelers I spoke to say they aren't sure the exact spot yet where they plan to see the eclipse, but they know they're going to have a priceless view while here in the state of Tennessee. Of course, you definitely want to wear these glasses, though, Kim. Maybe the welding uh, mask are not as safe, but these glasses that are certified are definitely your best bet. All right, Kayla, thank you so much. And you did a great job. You did a great job out thank there. Thank you. You did a great job. Well, we have a list of solar eclipse events on our website, newschannel9.com.